Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Capricorn Sun, Moon, and Rising. For, um, <coughs> for the Capricorn Sun, Moon, and Rising for the Deer to Wake from September 2017. This, um, what is here for you, the Capricorns? What is here for you, the Capricorns? What is here for you, the Capricorns? Okay, in this week, um, it is the Deer of the Week, and the week is the week of the Fool. So this is a new journey for all you Capricorns out there. This is a wonderful experience, wonderful situation that will be coming in. For whatever situation that has been happening, you're going to find out that justice is going to prevail. Good news is coming up. You and the lovers is going to be positive good situation that will be happening in your lives okay um this week is from the 18 until the 24th and we have the zodiac energy of the hurt and the air you have absolutely no regrets and this is good for you capricorns no regrets whatever situation that at spell you have absolutely no regrets for you capricorns you're really seeing that this situation is a situation where um, you are moving away from a situation where this is the end of um, a situation that has been happening in your life okay it's a situation where you're understanding that um, certain things certain aspects certain situation that has been happening you're moving away from it and you have absolutely no regrets let's see what else is happening Let's see what else is happening for you, Capricorns. What else is happening for you, Capricorns? Okay. On Monday, we have the energy vibration of the King of Cups. And this situation can be a situation for the people who are having partnership with the Pisces, the Cancer, or the Scorpion. And this is a wonderful family. This is a wonderful connection. Whoever this person is, whether he's a, he's a, he's a Cancer or a Pisces or a Scorpion, you... Capricorns are having a wonderful relationship. Whatever that was unbalanced is now healed, and this is going to be wonderful and positive. Oh, as we move forward, we have the energy vibration of the Six of Wands on Tuesday for you, Capricorns. It's going to be a wonderful, wonderful day on Tuesday. Positive energies are coming in. Uh, on Tuesday someone is going to be connecting with you this person is a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn and this is going to be positive wonderful news this person will be bringing to you so this is just going to be wonderful whenever this news come it is as if uh, it's something that you have been waiting on legal situations that sort of a thing um, you, you, you it's as if your lawyer calls you or as if someone bless you with news that has to be taken but this is a legalities and that sort of a thing if you were waiting on something from uh, immigration or whatever it is it's going to be positive on Tuesday you will have a message about this good news it's coming from a state so it's coming from authority um, government authority or that sort of thing of authority um figure that sort of a thing and now i'm knowing oh, what is happening here okay as we look at the middle of the week as we look at the middle of the week and i keep on getting um double energies for you capricorns i haven't got the slightest idea why but i kind of know why because you you masters the energy the earth energy so I guess that is the reason why I can't seems to get this card up I have double energies because I have the energy first some people will be moving away from the energy of the lovers and some people are going to be regretting it so I have three energies that just crowned in your week some people are going to be moving away from the energies of the lovers so moving away from a relationship and um, some some people will be regretting it whether your partner will be regretting it maybe there was a relationship that you were in or maybe you started a relationship and you're moving away from it and thinking this is not i really 
but what I really want in my life and your partner is re really regretting it for whatever reason I guess this person fell in love with you and you're deciding you know I better move away from this because this is not what I want in my life so it could be it could be this because obviously when you're leaving the lovers you're you, you can be leaving the lovers away and move into something which is much better and when you're seeing the regrets it's as if uh, you thought that something would be different you thought it's as if you know um, you have information about something but then you're thinking that maybe it's different and then you realize you know it's better that I end it and move on and some people are going to be doing that as we look at Thursday we have uh, a positive energy for a lot of people who have legal matters this is going to be very good um, for the women you're going to win big for the men you're going to be justified win big and new opportunities are going to be open up so if say if you have legal man matters or um, conflicts with other people and that sort of a thing the women are going to be justified and the men are going to be also justified it can also be that uh, there is someone the Queen of Swords and justice is going to stand up against her whoever this Queen of Swords is justice is going to stand up against her and you're going to see a positive outcome to this situation so whatever happened is as if this Queen of Sword have done something against you it could be an Aquarius a Gemini or a, a Libra and justice the energy of justice is going to stand up against her and said no hell no and um there is going to be a positive outcomes because good things are going to be happening for you because justice is protecting you so whatever is happening is a as a sort of a, something injustice has happened to you because you have the Queen of Sword or something injustice has happened to you and then justice is going to come in and make that balance and then um, wonderful new um, situation is going to happen it can be that someone who is an Aries and Leo an, Aries, um, an Aquarius a Gemini of an a Libra did something and justice is going to come in and an unjust that situation and then your life is going to start flowing in a positive way on Friday you have a situation um, that you're moving away from the the king of ones whatever the situation is is that you're moving away from the king of ones but it can also be a victory that you left the king of wands but he's coming back in your life for a positive thing but what I'm feeling is that for a lot of people um, it's going to be you're moving away from someone someone who's an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius and you some of you are moving away from him and nearly um, halfway to leaving him and some of you are connecting with a Sagittarius some of you are having a new beginning with a Sagittarius some of you are justified with a Sagittarius which is very good so this is very positive so whatever the situation is you're seeing here that this is working out um, it can work out in a good way for some people it can work out in a certain way with some other people so this is extremely positive whatever the situation is some of you will be leaving an um, a Aries and a Leo behind and some people will be um, you know starting a new relationship with a Sagittarius which is very good so I'm always getting these three readings for you guys on Saturday money will be coming in to you guys there is a message about nine of Pentacles that money will be coming in to you guys and this is going to be very good very positive whatever the situation is money will be coming in to you guys there's a message that money will be coming in nine of Pentacles is money that you weren't expecting so congratulations on Saturday you will receive that letter as we move forward all the lies and backstabbing is has come to an end all the lies that people were telling blocking your um, your material needs is going to come to an end and this is for you Capricorn women so for the people that were blocking you and lying whatever and 
blocking your um, blocking your your um, materialistic needs it's all going to come to an end you have this on Sunday so it's all going to come to an end so whatever lies whatever things that was happening it's all going to come to an end so here we are the no regrets in this week which is very good for you Capricorns very good um, love is going to be the for focus for you Capricorns in this week because some people will be leaving a relationship behind some people will be realizing that whatever the situation is that whatever that was going on um, it is no longer um, you know make in it's, it's it's no longer viable for you um, it's not doing anything good for you and you will be leaving a situation behind love is the most focus on Monday the whole week um, justice on Thursday which is extremely good on Friday some people will be uh, leaving the Aries and the Leos behind some people will be connecting with the Sagittarius um, some people will be standing up against and victorious against the Aries and the Leos okay this is wonderful on some such um, Saturday you know you receive a message about money that you weren't expecting and this is going to be extremely good so whatever the situation that is happening for you ladies and gentlemen however this week is going to affect you I am saying to you be positive over the situation and um, you are going to be coming out on top you Capricorns okay I'm looking a very dusty I don't know why okay let's see what's happening yes 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 isn't this wonderful yes it is okay so I'm working with Archangel Michael and he says new beginnings and a fresh start Thank you for bringing new opportunities and offering support and for helping me release and heal my past. Fill me with trust as I experience these life changes. And this is wonderful. So congratulations, you Capricorn. There's new beginnings and a fresh start coming in. So, um, you know, thank, thank you for the bringing me opportunities and offering support and for helping me releasing and healing my past fill me with the trust as i experience these life changes so this is good so here we are no regrets because there's coming in a new beginning okay i'm calling up in the essence ascension card the ascendance masters to release the message Archangel Metatron. Oh, this is wonderful because we, uh, this is second time Archangel Metatron is coming up. So, for you Capricorns, you work with Archangel Metatron, most of you. And he is saying, You're blessed to receive this card for the mighty universal angels, Archangel Metatron, who is coordinating the ascension of the planet, is touching you. He is illuminating your aura with his golden orange light as he works with your stellar gateway chakra. Your message is to relax and allow Archangel Metatron wings to enfold you. Ask to visit him at his ascension retreat in Luxor during meditation or sleep so that you can receive his guidance. This may come as through the thought of a whisper or a feelings. When you act sincerely for help on your ascension journey, Metatron will open new doors for you and guide you. I attune to Archangel Metatron today. So this is wonderful. I attune to Archangel Metatron today. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to say to you, have confidence, whatever it is. Archangel Michael, ask Archangel Michael to lend you is courage and fortress help me to realize that I am one with all that is divine wisdom strength love and creative abundancy and healing allow me to 
confidently and peacefully um, go about my daily lives it is going to be wonderful the fool is here twice it's going to be a lot of new beginnings for a lot of you Capricorns so whatever is happening be aware and know that um, only love is real and I want to say thank you to each and every person that has that has prayed for me and has remember me through the time of the hurricane thank God nothing happened so I'm here doing the um, um, the readings I do believe that um, everything happened for a reason I do believe when there is prior and power of prior in an area you will realize that uh, um, certain things do not I've always tried to keep positive everyone was um, you know in chaos and I was trying to be positive um, I make sure that I could have contact with my son which is um, very important to me so here we go thank you for all your support during the time and I want to say to each and every person um, namaste until next week